What's up, YouTube? Preseason testing done. Ferrari has the upper hand with <laughs> Vettel having scored the fastest lap over the two weeks and Lewis Hamilton not far behind. It seems like Ferrari does seem the strongest but again we know that first that preseason testing doesn't reliably predict the result of the season as whole and in fact we know next to nothing about how the season is going to turn out maybe maybe Mercedes win another world title maybe it's Vettel's time to shine maybe it's Leclerc and maybe Racing Point does is the debut season by winning the F1.5 title and, well, we don't really know. What we do know is where do we go from here. We go to Australia in two weeks time, uh, right after, right, here, right after we go to the Hong Kong E3. I'm, I know in an internet cafe <laughs> next to my house. <laughs> So, yeah. Now, uh, first off, it's the chain back questioner board, which Dan is still in the lead. And let's look at question number 12, strongest team on winter testing. It was um, Vettel, as I just told you, with Hamilton not far behind, but again, we can't draw conclusions yet. But that leaves Dan on the lead and no one with a 20th question in the bag yet. But we're gonna have to wait and see. For the Chain Bar Bingo versus, we had already made this prediction of the sponsor being investigated for fraud and the result of the mission winner scandal for Ferrari has resulted in this. Ferrari having to remove the mission winner name. Bottas fighting team orders? Well, he said this to the media. I've always been a team fighter, but I've also found out there are limits to that. Sometimes you have to think about yourself. If I always support others and never think about my own results, I'll never reach the goals I have. It's possible to be a team player, but also think about yourself, and that's what I want to show this season. If that situation arises again, I'll handle it differently than I did then. <laughs> so that leaves us with one and a half out of 64 that Bota fighting team orders on the media is worth half a point. Let's see if he actually does it. Now for my main predictions board, we have a uh, president of Mexico having a scandal involving Mexican Grand Prix. We may have uh, the 2019 be the last Mexican Grand Prix ever. Uh, for the top list pictures, we already have um, Charles Leclerc. Lewis Hamilton and Daniel Ricciardo. That's three out of seven or 0.45. That's a total of 3.45 out of 25. And so here's our situation so far. 14.95 in total. So I guess we're going to have to wait for more points and here's the the next stop at the Brazilian Grand Prix and my one to watch is going to be Checo and Lance from Racing Point well Checo and Lance especially Lance mostly Lance I love Lance he's so cute Whatever the case, I invite you to follow me on Instagram and I guess I'll see you on the next one in two weeks at the Brazilian, I mean the Australian Grand Prix.